We arrived at the caravan park in Iluka in quite heavy rain, so we quickly set up and bunkered down until the rain cleared. After that, we were able to go and check out an amazing sunset on the river. Putting this video together I realised we hadn't really taken very much footage of the caravan park or the caravan. Unfortunately we were sandwiched in between two other vans so we felt a little bit shy about talking too much so this is about all we've got. Here's Richard installing the anti-flap kit for the first time. How's it going? <laughs> oh, it's going really well. Now that we sort of like knew what the, uh, what's the name of that screw that we had to put in? Grub screw. The grub screw. Got a lovely grub screw. Here we are, set up at the Anchorage Holiday Park in Iluka, in New South Wales. We've got our anti-flap kits on, got our awning out. It was raining last night, but we're all set up today. We've got our kitchen, we've got our new little stools to sit on. Everything's set up. Playground at Iluka, isn't it lovely? The pirate theme. Yay! <laughs> what have you learned up there? <laughs> Heading over to Yamba in the distance, and this is at Iluka Beach. Over there. The first big catch of the year. Don't know what breed it is, but it looks delicious. Really cool, Debbie. I think I caught a flathead. Nice. Oh. My first fish on my new rod. Well oh, done. But let him go. Okey doke. Got a face off. Between pelican and a little bite, which Richard just caught. Oh, little fish. So that's the last of our bait. Yeah, we've got a bit. Oh, well, at least we ended on catching a couple. We did. Uh, how are we going there, Deb? Um, not too good. We're using lures at the moment. Not getting any bites at all, just catching seaweed. Yep. Even the pelican who came across to us has now disappeared out and he's given up. Yep, no puffer fish either. <laughs> he's given up on us. So.
caravan park that we're staying at in Iluka, it's called the Anchor Ridge Caravan Park, that's its own jetty. So I thought I'd just pop down here to, to show you the colour of the sunset that uh, comes over the Clarence River. It's a little bit spooky in here, but uh, you'll be amazed at the colour, which you can probably see already. But um, yeah, so we had an amazing one last night, and this one's not as good, but there's the colour that you can see. Pretty amazing. Try to go fishing again this afternoon. No luck. Lots of snags. Should be a butcher. Well, here we are at the Shark Bay picnic area, day use only. Here we can see the shorebirds that come and migrate to this area from often a, quite a distance away. Anyway, let's go down the track and see what the beach looks like. Only a short track from the day area. Must remember this is a national park, so no dogs allowed. And a bit of things, a bit of debris washed up on the beaches and I think obviously people like building structures out of all the um, debris. We can drive along here, there's a um, four wheel drive entry somewhere along a bit further up but we won't be doing that today. that the recent floods must have washed up on this beach. There's our Luca Fluff. We're in Bundjalung National Park. Hey Debbie, where are we and what are we doing? We're at the at, at Iluka and we're doing the Iluka Bluff Lookout Walk. And it looks like we have to walk up a number of stairs. And we're in a platform at the moment with an information board, but here's the lookout. Well, not the lookout, but here's a vista from where we are. Wow, you can see Yamber over the, in the distance. That's Yamber. And then we've got the Pacific Ocean.
here we are at Iluga Luff Beach and certainly the waves are crashing and there's a guy going fishing over here which I hope he uh, has taken all the safety precautions doesn't seem to be wearing any uh, life jackets or anything but each to their own We'll be back in such a lovely place.